Hey guys, remember to check the link down below for your chance to win a Gamdias headset, courtesy of Gamdias, the number one gaming source for all gaming hardware. Yo, what's going on guys, my name is Chris, your host in this Destiny video, and in today's Destiny video, I'm going to be showing you the new exclusive PlayStation Network content that is coming to the Taken King, well, that's coming to Destiny, the Echo Chamber Strike. It's all got gameplay and everything, and this is all from an interview at E3 2015 that uh, Deej was in. And it is exclusive PSN content such as the armor and the new Scout Rifle, the Jade Rabbit, can also be seen in this. Now, it is a timed exclusive content until Fall 2016 when the Xbox One will get it. As you do know already, we are going to be getting the Hawkmoon and the other PlayStation exclusives pretty soon. But you can also see here the new subclasses, but what's most impressive about this is the fact that the Guardians have to carry around this Orb of Light. This Orb of Light is sort of like a key, it acts like uh, an unlock system for secret rooms or other passages in the Strike. This is also vital because you can't actually shoot with it. You, we don't know if you can melee or throw a grenade, but it does open up the fact that you guys have to use teamwork to get through the strike. Bungie have always wanted people to play like this, be it in the Trials of Osiris to get to the lighthouse, or in Crota without cheesing him. They've wanted where people will work together, escort people, be able to work as a team and not have to go in and say, Oh, it's this strike, I can just walk through it or AFK. No, you actually have to do it with the orb holder. Now, as well as this, you want to know what the story is. What's the story behind this? Well, it's basically the Vex are trying to do or redo everything you've done and bring back Sekryon to the future before you kill him. So basically, the Nexus, you're, before you kill it, they're bringing it to the future so you don't kill it and it undoes everything. That's the kind of idea of it and you're sent in to stop it with your fire team. Now, this Orb of Light also, by the looks of it, opens up secret treasure rooms. Now, we don't know if these are actual treasure rooms with things in them or if they're, you know, as I said, other passages around the strike. The strike does look very big. Now, we haven't seen any bosses, but what we have seen is the subclasses, mainly the Warlock shredding shit up, and that is why I'm going back Warlock. I mained Hunter and Titan for a bit, gave up my Warlock, but oh, I feel bad now because I need to go back and just shoot lightning from my hands. I mean, I basically am a Jedi. My life is complete. Anyway guys, that is all for this video. If you did like it in any way, shape or form, please remember to leave a like. If we can get three likes, that would be amazing. It would make my day. Uh, as well as that, make sure you subscribe for more daily Destiny content. My name is Chris, your host in this Destiny video as I said at the start. And I hope you have an amazing week guys. Take care.